Roughly 6,575 days ago, the second child of attorney and Mrs. June Hiner was born. Well, that was me. I was their first daughter and was deduced to be named as Angelica Bless. But unfortunately, or should I say luckily, my mom got exhausted during my grandfather's birthday. So instead of laboring on January 27, 1992, I was born on the same day of my grandfather's birthday. And so, they included Virginia on my name as trail to my grandfather's name. Frankly speaking, I somehow loathed the name though. <laughs> As I was saying, I am the second child of my parents. I have a brother, Angelo. When we were still young, I guess I can say that my brother and I were really close. Funny thing. <laughs> we can talk about a lot of gibberish stuff, these and those, blah blah blah, but now we seldom talk any longer. I don't know why. <laughs> Perhaps we're just both busy with our studies already, huh? <laughs> So anyways, did you know that during my childhood years, I was a bit of a declaimer. I joined a lot of declamation contests before, but as I grew up, I think I lost the zeal for it. I know that it doesn't show much, so don't bother my way of speaking, okay? Never mind, I just thought I should mention. <laughs> business uh, teenage years I'm really timid believe it or not <laughs> I know a lot of my friends would probably object but I deem I'm a shy type individual okay? <laughs> ha, ha, ha. I'm kind of introverted I'm the sort of person that won't talk to you unless you'll be the one to initiate the conversation so I guess that's why people who don't really know me think that I am snob, bizarre, or masungit. Well, everyone has their own valid opinions, right? That's 
sweeping you off your feet. Sorry if I may be moody at times and if my flaws are too perceptible to be concealed. I may not be perfect, but I really, 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 really try to be the best Angelica that I can be. Get tangled up in me. So, so, so emo. Anyways, now I am currently taking up entrepreneurship. I could still remember that throughout my kindergarten days, I dreamt of being a doctor. Who knew that I'd be in the business field? And it's not because I love math. Duh, that's an absolute lie. But then, I think I discovered an inclination in business. I'm not an excellent student, but I try to stand out in what I like and pursue on what I believe in. When I was still a kid, even just a bar of chocolate or a Barbie doll could make me smile. But now that I'm about to be called as a woman, I learned to value more significant gifts that life had shown me. So this is me, Angelica, turning 18, a woman in the making. <laughs> <laughs> 